Praise the Lord. Thank you, Lord Jesus Christ. Hi, welcome in. Let's go to God's word. How can you use spiritual discipline in your life to produce fruit in other areas of your life? My child, when the Lord God speaks to you, never take his words lightly and never be upset when he corrects you. For the Father's discipline comes only from his passionate love and pleasure for you. Even when it seems like his correction is harsh, it's still better than any father on earth gives to his child. Proverbs 3 verses 11 to 12. Our earthly fathers disciplined us for a few years, doing the best they knew how, but God's discipline is always good for us so that we might share in his holiness. No discipline is enjoyable while it is happening. It's painful, but afterward there will be a peaceful harvest of right living for those who are trained in this way. Hebrews 12, verses 10 to 11. I correct and discipline everyone I love. So be diligent and turn from your indifference. Revelation 3, 19. Discipline. Once we surrender our hearts, minds, and lives to God, our desires do not govern our lives. Jesus said to pick up the cross follow him. The governing authority of the kingdom of God is not the same as this world. In fact, it is quite the opposite. The first shall be last in God's kingdom. So if you want to be a leader, you must be a servant. Great warriors are men and women who will wash the feet of others. It is nothing like this world. It requires discipline, which means doing the God things even when it is not easy, is not popular, or does not benefit us directly at the moment. Disciplined followers of Christ do his will even when it is against our own wills. We must live our lives according to God's word, the higher and ultimate standard of discipline. It's a higher standard, but it is one by which our lives will produce fruit for his kingdom for all eternity. Heavenly Father, when I get physically and emotionally tired, give me the mindset and willpower to continue doing the things I know are right according to your word, for this is the spiritual discipline I seek. Amen.